Hey y'all, welcome back, or welcome if you are new to another cleaning video. So I'm getting started with washing a load of laundry, and I did not get finished with the laundry today. So in tomorrow's video, I'm going to clean the bathrooms. I'm going to really deep clean my bedroom, and I'm wanting to start doing different rooms for different days that way by the time the week is over I've cleaned all the rooms and things can be manageable a lot easier so if you're new here I'm using the downy unstoppable beads I like the blue ones those are my favorite I'm also using some oxyclean odor blasting powder and then I use the clear life um, I almost said dryer sheets, laundry detergent sheets, and I always do a heavy load. So since it's raining outside, I figured we could make it cozy in the house, and I'm going to light up all of these faux candles. I will have a lot of this stuff linked in the description box down below, so if there's a cleaning product or the lights that y'all see or the laundry detergent, whatever it is, I will have those in the description box for y'all. But as you can see, we have got a mess on our hands. I recently cleaned our whole house, um, I think the day, after, the day before yesterday. So it's not too bad in here, but this is just that everyday mess that gets created when you cook something. So last night I made homemade uh, fried shrimp. Uh, boiled corn and then did some mashed potatoes. I wish I had filmed that for y'all because I think it would have been fun to see and have like a little meal idea. And then later on in today's video, Aaron actually fried fish that he caught while he was fishing at the lake. And I, when he brought home the fish, I was like, oh my gosh. Did I just re fall in love with him again? I don't know what it is. There's something about a man going out hunting or fishing and then bringing food home. That really does something for me. Can I get a thumbs up if you agree? <laughs> um, this little pantry area was just kind of a, a big mess. So I just wanted to straighten that up a little bit. Same thing over here. Just kind of straightening up my seasoning. And then I realized y'all couldn't even see what I'm doing. So I moved the camera over. Um, but just getting all that straightened up. This is where I keep most of my seasonings and my air fryer and paper towels, paper plates, kind of stuff like that. And now we are going to put away all of the clean dishes I have two cats and ever since I got cats I have stopped burning candles but I do have a candle slash wax warmer and whenever I put large candles on here I feel like it never burns all the way but I do have this really small candle in the mason drawer shape it's so cute from Dollar Tree I don't know if they still have these but that's where I got it and I figured the yellow would be kind of good for fall y'all I don't have any fall looking candles so hopefully the yellow is fall enough but um just have that over there and you can see that it did melt all the way down and it only took about an hour to melt so i suggest if you use a candle warmer um to put like small candles on there because i feel like it works better but i'm just getting all these dishes from last night cleaned up that way whatever we cook today like the fish um there's just not a lot of mess in the sink i am never motivated to cook if my sink is full of dirty dishes so getting those cleaned up makes it to where i will cook at home more and I, we've actually cooked at home i think every day for a while because i don't remember the last time we went out to eat Hey 
And I'm going to be using this barkeeper's friend to clean the sink today and the faucet. I found these little scouring pads for 25 cents each, which is amazing at this, uh, it's like a, I guess like a liquidation or overstock. I don't really know what you would call it, but it's like a bargain store um, locally in our town. And quite a few of you asked where I live um, from yesterday's video. And I live in rural North Carolina. I do not live in a large city or anything like that. I've, I think some people thought I lived in a big city. I definitely do not. It takes us at least 30 minutes to get to a, a like semi-large city. And then if we want to go somewhere like Raleigh or Charlotte, which we probably never would, um, it would take us like an hour and a half to get to, I think Charlotte's an hour and a half away. So I live outside of all of that. Um, I'm surrounded by cows donkeys goats one of our neighbors has chickens and goats so very country girl over here Does it take to be happy? How many times do you have to feel lonely before you get the chance to meet someone? Before you get to meet someone like you? How many songs can you write? I have forgotten a few days in a row. But I downloaded the Holy Bible app on my phone. I also downloaded the Women's Bible app on my phone or Bible for Women, something like that. Anyways, it's a really cute app. But y'all, there's so many commercials in that app and it really throws me off because I'm like, girl, I'm trying to read the Bible. I do not want to see an advertisement for Timu today. <laughs> so if you want a Bible app that is not flooded with advertisements, the Holy Bible is a good one. And you can pick like all different, you know, King James, uh, NIV English translated version, whatever one you want to pick. Um, anyways, this is where I put all my cleaning products. But all that being said, I am going to share with y'all a verse of the day at the end of this video. And I think I'm going to start doing it on the app a lot more because my book doesn't always have a Bible verse. Sometimes it's just like a positive message and those can be really long. So I would rather show y'all like a short little Bible verse on my phone at the end of each video. So look forward to that if that's something y'all like to see. Uh, I'm wiping my countertops down with the Caldrea uh, Sea Salt. I think it's uh, a Neroli. Anyways, I will have that linked down below in the description box as well. Um, I'll just link all the things I can remember to link today down there because sometimes I do get questions from y'all like where did you get this and sometimes I don't have time to go find the link real quick so I'll just make sure that all the information is in the description box so it's easy for y'all to find. Okay, if I got you, we don't have to stay. We can do what we want to. Baby, I just found the answers. Baby, I just found the answers in you. Yesterday, I asked everyone on Instagram what videos y'all would like to see or what would you like to see more of in my videos and 
all of you were mentioning like frugal meals, uh, fall inspired recipes. So tomorrow I am filming another homemaking video, but I do want to see just what I have in my cabinets and see if I can come up with a fall dessert without actually going to the store and getting ingredients to do so i think that will be kind of frugal and uh, because we're not going out and spending money for it and also um it will be fall so i will have more things like that in the cleaning videos today is just kind of cleaning but i do have this little haul right here erin went into family dollar and got a couple of these towels by the way they are super soft this is a couple of ingredients he needed to make the fish today. So he got the Louisiana fish fry and some vegetable oil. We were almost out of paper plates and we thrive on those. Um, he got some of these cupcakes, which are really good. And some of the Scott uh, paper towels. And then also he got this cute fall cup. And I thought, well, good for him. He picked out a cute cup. And then he said it was for me. So isn't that sweet? I like it. I'll use it tomorrow. <laughs> anyway, uh, there's a big mess over here. We off camera we went and took off trash, and when I got back, I wanted to tackle this area because it is a clutter zone in our house. And if I don't take care of it at least once a month, it just starts to look awful. Um, but speaking of videos and stuff like that, um, every video from now on is going to be a homemaking video but we're still going to share our grocery hauls cooking decorating um home updates diys like i want to paint our refrigerator soon um we painted our door recently so doing the updates kind of incorporating them into a homemaking video that way all of you like the videos um, because there's a little bit of everything in each video instead of separating all the content now it's just all going to kind of blend in and make sense all together uh, by the way any more type of really sit down chatty videos like I posted yesterday if I ever feel like doing that again which I don't know if I'm going to uh, because they are kind of like hot topics and it could bother some people but y'all received it really well so thank you for that um i have a second channel that i don't really do anything on so if i ever feel like sharing something i'll just throw it over there um and i'll leave this channel to homemaking and updates and decorating cooking all the fun light-hearted stuff Look out, here she comes The woman that I love In that second pink chair that nobody ever sits in is where I will throw all the mail because most of the time it's not mine. Um, so I don't really go through it. But at some point I do decide to go through it. And then I take whatever um, I don't know, you know, if it's something Aaron needs or if he doesn't need, I just hold on to it and then I let him go through it and then I just shred up whatever he doesn't want and he does whatever he does with the stuff he keeps. I don't even know what he does with the mail he keeps. <laughs> mail is one of those things I wish they just wouldn't send us mail. Like why does mail have to exist? Can everything be digital? That would be great. She won't be mine. I listen when she talks. I watch her when she Speaking of home updates, uh, maybe I'll do it tomorrow because I'm looking at this and I'm like, man, I want to paint this black. So in tomorrow's video, I know for sure I'm going to um I needed to wash a fitted sheet. I know so random, but um I need to put that back on the bed. I need to put away the clothes that we fold in today's video, um, clean the bedroom, the bathrooms, and then I will paint this little island area, just the inside of it. It's pink right now, but I'm going to paint it black, girls. I'm going to paint it black, just like the door. And guys, I know there's like 10% men that watch my videos, so hi, hello. I hope I'm motivating you to clean. <laughs> 
Anyways, here's my man right behind me. He's watching me. <laughs> and he's about to cook fish, too. So, I'll show y'all. Um, I didn't film him cooking the fish, but I will show y'all the fish done. And maybe y'all would, would prefer not to see a fish get skinned. Anyways, y'all are probably wondering what kind of fish it was. And it was crappy. I don't know what how y'all pronounce it. There's other ways to pronounce it, but we call it crappy over here. I already have a load of clean laundry in the dryer, so I'm going to take that out and put it on the couch. And then I'm just going to go ahead and put the clothes in the washing machine in the dryer. Those are going to be the ones that we take care of in the next video. But since I'm going to be doing these videos six days a week, I figured I don't have to get everything done in one day. I can just keep going the next day. So I hope you all really enjoy these types of videos. And that they do bring you a lot of motivation and ideas like when we do the recipes and stuff. Um, and I get a new grocery budget in about seven days, which I'm very excited for. I told Erin, I was like, I don't, I'm, I'm not going to the grocery store. I, we will eat what we have in the cabinets. <laughs> Because there's enough in there. You know, sometimes when you have food at home, but you maybe want something different. So you go to the store and you get something. Well, I really want to challenge ourselves to just eat what we have instead of doing that. Um, but when I do get my new grocery budget in, I am going to plan the meals around recipes that I can share with y'all. But also recipes that we would both enjoy. Sometimes I will go on Pinterest and I'll try out new recipes. And either one of us doesn't like it or it's something like, mm, don't know about that. So I kind of don't look at Pinterest a lot for ideas. But I do want to share a lot of different things with y'all. So I'm, I'm kind of excited. I already have a little bit of an idea. If I have oatmeal, I don't know if I have oats. But I thought about making some no-bake cookies tomorrow with oats. And um, I think maybe like some peanut butter. And I have pumpkin spice. So I could make it fall related. I'm not gonna lie. Don't know what I do without you. Maybe we could try. Try to figure out a way to put our past aside. I've realized I only want you. I hope it's not too late I want you back here with me We never should have said it's So on this day, which is I think Friday I was listening slash kind of watching other cleaning YouTubers I used to not do this but I wanted some motivation today while I cleaned as well um, To help me keep going uh, so, I watched a video from uh, Chelsea Mobile Home. I played a video from Gracefully Grace. I think that's her channel name. Oh gosh, I don't want to forget people that I watched because I'm wanting to kind of give them shout outs in this video right now. Maria Loves Asbury. I watched one of hers. It was her cleaning her dad's house. And I I feel like there was another video. Or oh duh. I was I watched a couple from Love Meg 2.0, which she's been posting older videos right now. So it's fun to kind of go back and see what was going on um, when she posts those videos. But I've been watching her videos as well. If y'all don't know, she is like one of uh, basically family to me i feel like um she's one of my closest friends we visit each other quite often and we talk on the phone all the time it's funny because 
I was thinking about messaging her yesterday, and before I could text her, she texted me, and we're always doing stuff like that. But um, here is the fried fish Aaron made, and it's really good. He soaks it in salt um, the day, the night before, so it takes all that fishy taste out of it. Um, miles better than eating a fish stick, if you know what I mean. It's amazing. He could have a fish and a steak truck <laughs> sometimes we make jokes about a, if he had a food truck he could sell a lot of steaks um, and i feel like he could anyways this is super dusty over here because i've okay if you want a tv stand that doesn't look like it's dusty get that one because i rarely clean that thing it just feels like it doesn't get dirty which is weird um but the black stuff i have it it gets dusty overnight anyway had to play that phone for y'all i got it at tj maxx speaking of one of you requested that i do an updated home tour and i want and plan to do one um once i get all my fall stuff outside like the mums and whatever else I'm going to decorate with out there because I'm not done yet but we live within a budget so I can't just go out today and buy stuff to do it I have to wait until we have either saved for it or it's just within the budget which each month we do have a budget for videos because that's my job and with making videos you kind of sometimes have to spend money to make money so um that's why you'll see a lot of updates and decorating because those are the things that help us um anywho <laughs> this tv stand is really dusty it's right next to the cat litter boxes and i feel like they walk on this sometimes so it gets really dirty i just cleaned this a couple of days ago but it needed it again today so i figured why not go ahead and do that and i think the majority of the cleaning is done so i'm just going to show you all what the rooms look like cleaned up and then i'll show you that verse at the end of the video but i don't know what i was even telling y'all earlier oh the home tour i will have a home tour soon once i get everything done outside the inside is done and in that video i will show y'all and let you know where everything came from Can we work it out? Only time will tell. It's gonna take a lot. Alright y'all, thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more cleaning videos, click that playlist on the top right. And if you want to start from the beginning of 2024, click that playlist on the bottom left. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.